Well, the Big Cat Public Safety Act has been endorsed by the Fraternal Order of Police, the National Sheriff's Association, and numerous other state and local law enforcement agencies. Because 500-pound carnivores pose a serious and very real threat to first responders, law enforcement officers, entire communities around the country. The photo behind me is not staged. This bill is also endorsed by the Humane Society of the United States and countless other animal welfare organizations because lions and tigers do not belong in urban apartments or in cages in suburban backyards. And because private citizens simply do not have the resources to care for dangerous animals that are meant to roam over hundreds of square miles. As was stated, this bill is supported by the AZA, not opposed by the Zoological Association of America, the Trade Association for Small Roadside Type Zoos. Because ripping newborn cubs from their mothers moments after their birth to use them as props and photos is already cruel enough. But then, once they're too big to be safely held, brutally killing them is just wrong. Nearly 65,000 Americans have signed a Change.org petition calling for the immediate passage of this bill because the Netflix series Tiger King showed the world in stark relief how exploitive, dangerous, and inhumane this tiny so-called industry is. This bill should be served by every American because right now taxpayers shoulder the cost of monitoring and regulating private owners and when big cats are rescued from horrific conditions or simply abandoned by overwhelmed owners, they pay for the care and feeding of these cats. I want to thank the many Republican members of Congress who support this bill, which is co-sponsored by more than half the House. I urge every member to stand with law enforcement community and stand up for those who need our help but cannot ask for that. Please vote for this bill. I yield back.